Hi, welcome to Myers ASMR. Thanks for being here. Relax yourself. Let it go. It's over. It's over. Let it all go. Hey, if it's not something that you desire, then thinking about it only keeps it active in your experience. So think about what you actually desire, what you actually want, not what you don't want. So, I ordered from a place around me called BGR, or Burgers Grilled Right. And this is my first time with this ahi tuna burger. So, ooh, let's check it out. First time looking at it. Ooh, fries. Yes, yes. Look at that. They caught them skin on, but it's not a lot of skin on. They're still really good, though. Yeah. And not too cold, even after being being delivered. Don't you just love fries? Let me get my handy prop. This is that tuna burger. Oh, I put it on the, um, gluten-free bun because that's the way I'm living it's smelling fishy okay look at that tastes kind of fishy Definitely not the tuna you get in the can. This is like the unminced filet. So I think this is pickled ginger, mm. which I adore. So it's got pickled ginger, pineapple, and some type of mojo mayo sauce or something. came with teriyaki sauce on it, but I asked for no teriyaki simply because I'm cutting down on the sweets in my life. And believe me, I love some teriyaki, so I hope this tastes okay without it. This is a very interesting sandwich, I'm telling you. Never had these ingredients on a sandwich before. Hmm. Hmm. That is surprisingly good. I'm so glad I'm adventurous.
but so far the bread is holding together pretty well usually this gluten-free bread falls apart I mean it still looks like it might but so far so good I'm impressed You know, <clears throat> I was so tempted to get the, the pretzel bun, but I knew I wasn't going to feel good doing that to my gut, so I feel very good about myself with this gluten-free bun. I love when they look like this. Like when they've got some brown on them. They don't even need ketchup. Fries are so freaking good. I don't know how people mess them up. I like when they're soft. I like the soft ones. That one is hard. So I'm going to put that back. That looks great, doesn't it? I 
And I'd be like, why does she keep doing that? Fries are just so great. That's why. And I'm always looking for the perfect one. Yeah, I like when they're shaped like that. Because then they're soft. Like, when they're like that, that part's probably hard. Yeah, that one is hard. Mmm. I seem to like the fries better than the burger. Well, <clears throat> the bread is starting to come apart, but I'm almost done, so see how it's, that's pretty much how all the gluten-free breads act. And see how it gets, but if you're a faster eater, you could have probably had this finished, bef you know, before that really started to happen. I think the more you move it, it starts to break apart. almost too much ginger it's like piled up oh yeah I might have to take this off yeah now the bread is coming apart <clears throat> but still it was a good bread it did good Hey, if you know of a truly gluten-free bread that holds up, it doesn't start to shred like this, let me know. Ooh, ears itching. Don't know why. Let me know. Tuna burgers need to be more popular. Yeah.
This is so good. You know, I'm really grateful to my channel for expanding my horizons. And it's not that this food is, is so highly unusual, but I'd probably be eating some of the same tried and true stuff that I'm used to if it wasn't for this channel. So I'm glad that it's, it's you know, helping me expand and grow. I'm going to stop here pretty much at the end of the bread. I knew that was going to happen. Because I know how that gluten-free bread acts, but this one still held up pretty well, if you can believe it. Would I get it again? I would. If I was craving it. Um, I'd probably be so tempted to get it on, um, on a pretzel bun. Because I know that's not going to fall apart like that. But still, for, for gluten, gluten-free bread, I mean... It did pretty good. So hey, if it's something that you desire, then, oh, excuse me, the quote says, if it's not something that you desire, then giving it your attention only makes it more solid in your experience. If it's not something that you desire, then giving it your attention only makes it more solid in your experience. And hey, if you like what I'm doing here, like and subscribe, donate to my cash app. Um, catch me in the next video and may you find lasting happiness. Bye.